Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning in to my channel today. In today's video, we are going to be working on our community savings challenges as well as our battle of the boxes. So if you're interested in seeing how this turns out, please be sure to stay tuned. All right, you guys, again, my name is Brandy Janae. Welcome if you are new and welcome back if you're returning. We do have quite a few new subscribers, which is amazing. Thank you for joining the Hot Mess Express, <laughs> where I am your faithful <laughs> captain. Um, but yeah, so today, like I said, we're going to be working on our community savings challenges first. And I put those in this binder right now. We just have two that we're working on. We have this one from Ellie on Earth, and then we have this one from Donna, Powered by Creativity, and I typically start with this one. So for this one, it's $6 a day, three times a week, but I just do the $18 once a week and, you know, just kind of do my own thing. So let me make sure this is 18. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. Perfect. Let's, oh, wrong dice. All right, let's roll, see where we are. So number three gets two. Number six gets two. Oh, number six gets two more. I should just hold this, that'll be easier. All right, number four, self-care. Number four, number six, number three, number five, and number three. All right, so give generously did not get anything. Holiday did not get anything. Debt got $4 today. Self-care, one, two, three, four, five, six. Sweet. Abundance has two. One, two, three, four, five, six, and oh, poop. All right, and this money will all be saved until the end of the year. I think we unstuffed these December, it's December 7th or December 8th, and I can never remember, but it's one of those two days. Um, oh, and I forgot to read our, our sign for today. And this is from Bloom Paper Planners, just in case you missed that from Bloom Planners. Um, it is a super cute, like, desk easel. And it says, with this desk easel, 20% of the proceeds will go back to purchasing paper and pencils for school children in East Africa. So definitely check out bloomplanners.com, Bloom Daily Planners if you're looking it up. Um, and I have their link in the description box so that you can receive, I believe it's 10% off of your first order. It's either 10 or 20, I don't remember. Anyway, it's in the description box. It says, if you don't get out of the box you've been raised in, oof, you won't understand how much bigger the world is. And that is a quote by Angelina Jolie. Love that. And I really, really enjoy reading these every day. All right, let's see what we got for cash today. We have 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. 56, 7, 8, 9, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 77. So my priority today is going to be to complete the butterfly box. But before we do that, let's go ahead and scratch Ellie's challenge. Uh, and this is a community challenge that she does off, oh gosh, eight. She does offer this challenge. Um, if you go to her Etsy, well, just go to her page first and she'll give you more information. But if you go to her Etsy shop, 
she does allow you to sign up for the mailing list. And I think I heard she sends like over 200 of these out, which is really cool. So five, uh, it's eight. So let's put two back and get another five. All right, so eight, 13, 16, yes. Sweet. So that one is done. All right. And now it is time for the boxes. And number one, we have the butterfly box. And this is my challenge. I did also collaborate on this with um, Maria over at She Has, She's Got It. I completed all of her portion of the challenge though. So you won't see that in this one, which is why I really want to finish this one today. So we are going to do that. In the number two spot, we have the donut box, which is also, ooh, my hair, one of my savings challenges that can be found in my Etsy shop below. I have hair everywhere. Sorry, you guys. In the number three spot, we have this from GB over at Income Babes. It is the Christmas box. Whew which I have been working on this. I don't really do a lot for Christmas, so I'm not really sure if all this money will even go. I actually might all just go to holidays in general. That way, like all of them are covered. <laughs> but I'm not a big Christmas person, so I don't like go all out. My son is grown now, so, you know, I send him a couple books and we keep it moving. Um, this is the chocolate box and this is A for Alicia on Etsy and Saving with Alicia on YouTube. So that is the chocolate box. And I did, I cut the other part of it, but I forgot to add it. So we'll just add that in the next time. She, she posted another like addition to it. And I did cut it and laminate and all that jazz. And then I forgot to put it in there. So we'll just do that next time. And then I do have this monthly savings challenge. And this is from Owl Always Save. And once these challenges are completed, I will be sticking them directly in like the monthly savings challenges envelope that I have. So yeah. All right, but I always like to go through all of the books first, one round, and then after that, if I have money left, then I'll roll. But that way, you know, everything gets touched because I don't like the idea of one binder getting everything and then nothing else does. So for this one, normally I would just put, I would put um, the, what is this called? This money, the fake money, the pretend money. I can't think. <laughs> the prop bills. Normally I would put that in here, but I'm not going to do that this time because again, I am going to finish this today. So we should not have that many cars left. I need my four sided die for this one and lint. Ooh, y'all, I'm just really doing it. All right. So for this one, see, this one might take up, this is probably going to take up the majority of the money to be perfectly honest with you. And we're just going to kind of keep a running total, hopefully. All right, so let's roll. When it's blank, that means I get to choose, and I choose for that to be a dollar. <laughs> Two. We got a one. Ooh, this marker. And a one. So that is two, three, four, five. For this butterfly and now that one is completed but of course when we do the butterflies we have to I'm gonna just leave these out okay so we have to buy a net for a dollar buy a plant for a dollar and then let's see how much is it to hold the butterfly. Okay, we're gonna do another dollar. So that's plus three for that one. And now this butterfly is complete. Our next card is a task card and I think it's the last one, yes. And I do roll a six-sided die for the tasks. Okay, so we got a two for the new floors. So we're gonna add two. And now that one is complete. 
So these other ones should be butterflies. Butterfly number. Oh, my envelope ripped. That stinks. Okay, butterfly number four. Three. One. Two. One. So that's five, six, seven. Okay. And the reason why I'm finishing this one is because I have another new challenge that I really, really, really want to start in August. So I don't want three of my boxes to be over here. <laughs> All right. So then we have one for this, one for this. Oh, no. Shoot. That doesn't go there. Hold on. My bad. Oh, no. Yeah. One. Okay. One, two, three. So plus three. So now we're at $20 because it ended up being a one anyway. And I almost just cleared my calculator. Now, this is saying that I'm done, but that couldn't be. Am I missing a card somewhere? Or did I forget to mark off one of these one day? Two days. Or did I just do something wrong in general? Uh oh. One, two, three, four, five, six times three is 18. There's 18 cards. So apparently, I did not do this a couple times. Yeah, guys, all my butterflies are done. Okay, I knew I didn't have that many cards left. So apparently I skipped this at one point a couple times, two times I missed it. So that's one, two, three, four. I don't know. Ugh, four is eight. Oh gosh, four is 12. Okay, so plus 12 equals, so I owe the butterfly house $32, and then that makes this challenge 100% finished. And that is so exciting. Oh my gosh. This was so much fun. And this was the first box challenge I ever created. And I'm so excited. I did it and I love it. All right, what I say? $32. So let's do 20, 25. 30, 31, and 32. Oh my gosh. So now, first of all, where's my bell? Oh man. Oh. Ding, 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 ding. We kind of ring the bell, put a dollar in the ding, ding, ding challenge because we completed it. Whoop, whoop. Do I have, hold on. This is a lot. This is a lot going on over here. Okay, we're going to take this out. Do I have a tin? Sweet. And put that in there. Uh-oh. That goes in there. This goes back in here. And this goes back in here. Okay. It was like way too much. All right, sorry about that. Okay, so let's see what, how much we saved in this challenge. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I got money all mixed up. Some more 20s, ones, fives, and ones. Okay, so in this challenge, we saved a total of 50. I don't know who we is. I don't, I don't know why I keep saying we. Ain't no we's me. <laughs> I saved <laughs> 51, 50, 70, 90, 210, 230, 250, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So $276 saved in this challenge. And that, my friends, is amazing. <sighs> Yay! So we're going to add this to the completed challenge envelope. 
All right, and Butterfly House is officially retired. I just need to go through and take out the prop money. But I will do that at another time. Let's put those cards back. And we are moving on. And now, since we only have four boxes, we can go ahead and use the four-sided die to choose a box. So one, two, three, four would be the calendar one. Roll, uh. <laughs> Yeesh, roll a dice and add $10. Sheesh. Mm, okay. Three. So 13, 5, 10, gosh. 11, 12, and 13. Good night. <laughs> that felt kind of disrespectful. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> 13. Mm. Okay. All right. Mm. All right. Oh, shoot. And I was supposed to be going through all of them before I even did that anyway. Okay. So we'll just go backwards. Four, three, chocolate box. Oh, chocolate box. Be, be kind. Be kind. Y'all, this chocolate box. Woo this is the big one. I'm going to have an IOU. Oh, I got my itching. I already know this is a big one because GB just did this one. It, it, it almost... Oh, no. Okay, no. This ain't what I thought it was. Whew. Okay, never mind. $9 I can do. Okay. Sheesh. So $9 and then add one more dollar. And you have 10. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, man. I thought that was a different one. Mm-hmm. One of these little jokers. Oh, it's this one. $24. That's right. It was this one. That cup of hot chocolate. <laughs> Woo. Yeah, that cup of hot chocolate made her do a very long pause. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she almost cussed on that one, y'all. I ain't, I ain't even gonna lie. It was rough. That one, <laughs> that cup of hot chocolate took her over the edge. Woo, that's right. Okay, Christmas box. Let's pull a card. A lump of coal saves seven dollars. I never did figure out where to put these monies. Cause there's no spot for this. Yeah, there's no, I think, I, I'm almost positive these are the ones she puts in her little box. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Either way, we're just going to start sticking that, we're just going to start sticking that in here. And these are like our just extra, extra cards. But yeah, I'm pretty sure those are the ones she puts in her magical Christmas box that I don't have. But that's okay. And this is going to be the last one because we're out of money. Uh, like I said, I'm probably gonna have an IOU, which makes me sad, but it is what it is. I wanted to finish Butterfly Box today. So the donut box, I could cheat technically and not have an IOU. I could, but I ain't gonna do it. Oh, one of the things I also made for this challenge, which is available in the Ko-Fi shop, so it's a freebie. I did add cards because GB was like, there's nothing to make her go back to these extra sections which is where i was saying that i could cheat <laughs> but there really isn't anything that leads you back here these are just kind of like additional games and bonus games that you can play so i did make cards to go in here but they're all mixed in so i can't really show them to you but i did make cards that will force you to go back to these sections as well but after you do those cards you need to make sure you put them back in your pile so that you can do it multiple times but yes, those are in the description box below. And this is another one. Is this one that I use prop money for? Why do I have money back here? Or do I just keep it all in the same spot? Hold on. I think this is another one I use prop money for. Oh, yes, that's right. Because Marty over at Budgets and Chaos made me 
some cute little donut money. So let's see what we have left. Oh man, you guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I'm having a hot flash right now. So <sighs> getting older. <laughs> getting older is for the birds all right so i have this yummy 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 donut we are going to roll it got a two which is excellent so we are going to put a two in here We are going to put a two in here. And then you guys, we're that's it. We I'm not I'm not pressing my look today. I'm not, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. We're done. We're done. This extra, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. It's gonna be rolled over to the next time. So I am going to stick that in here. And we're gonna just we're gonna just roll we're gonna just roll it we're gonna roll it i'm not pressing my luck i don't want any ious <laughs> so that is it for this video i hope that you enjoyed it if you did please leave me a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so and hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever i post a new video you guys are amazing be safe be kind or be quiet and be well, and I'll catch you in the next one.